All right, Dungeon Master, what are we doing today? Today we are doing a battle simulation exercise story in some kind of alternate multiversal scenario in which Mentor Night Mist has brought together these scrappy individuals in Backdraft Roth, who is kind of angry at the world and damaging other people, uh, Scavenger Unity, who needs to learn how to use her powers more effectively, and Haunted Fanatic, trying to make sure that they can handle any kind of foe that gets thrown at them with a simulated Plague Rat adventure right. in the battle simulation room of the Freedom Tower. Cool. So I'll be leading the team with Mentor Night Mist, using the power to give plus one or minus three to all damage dealt by a target, so the targets to choose. Targets yes. to choose, cool. Each time that target deals damage, make it plus one or minus three. Nice. Uh, yeah, Backdraft Raw deals big damage but hurts everyone. Uh, Scavenger Unity has, you may play a mechanical golem or item card from your trash if you do not draw two cards and discard a card, so that's cool. And then uh, Haunted Fanatic only has 10 health and has the power Holy Unholy. Summon a relic card, Fanatic deals herself and one other target, one fixed infernal damage. Fixed. 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 Mm -hmm, so you can't reduce it. I can't reduce it with Night Mist, but maybe other things I can. Okay. Okay, Plague Rat's pretty mean. He got himself out a Plague Locus, which gives him plus one. It has nine health, and it will discover more ongoings. That's his setup? That's his setup. Okay. So he is going to go. He will play a card. He plays Lurking Plague. If there are fewer than eight villain ongoing cards in play, discover one ongoing card. Ongoing. Madness, maddening disorder. Play this next to an active, non-infected hero character. If there are none, discard this card and Plague Rat regains HP. The target next to this card is infected. The, this target deals the hero target with the highest HP 2 damage. That looks like Fnatic. That looks like Fnatic. Each infected hero deals itself one fixed toxic damage. When this goes out, so you get this, and then you deal yourself one fixed damage. Do you want to take that risk? It's a fixed. You're right. It says itself. I read fixed. Mm. Deals itself one. Still. Still. That's just going to happen right now, so I'll just bring you down to nine. Mm -hmm. This is going to blast the highest health, so we don't have to worry about the Fnatic getting killed by them right now. Okay. Old Plague Rat did hurt people that weren't infected. But also does stuff to people that are infected. Each infected hero character deals itself one. Th this one does do that to the infected. I think let's give it to it. Let's try. Okay. So right now you deal yourself one damage. Plague Rat deals the hero character with the highest HP. Oh, he's getting shuffled back in after the discover. Plague Rat deals the hero target with the highest HP three melee damage. That is raw, and three is plus one, so it is four. Bring it down to 27. And then that does it. Okay, so then he goes. If there are more than more villain ongoing cards in play, three or more, there are not, flip him. Otherwise, Plague Rat deals the hero target with the highest HP, which is Night Mist. H plus one. Ooh. Five damage. Ouch. Then play the top card of the villain deck. This is going to be Tooth and the Claw. Shuffle the villain trash into the villain deck. Plague Red deals the hero target with the highest HP, which is back to raw. Three plus one is four damage. Aim down to 23. If that target is not infected, discover one villain ongoing card and point next to that target. Oh, it's a different infected card. I really like this, that there's different types of infected. Before it was just infected and they did one thing. You have maddening... Maddening disorder. disorder. And now I have wasting sickness. The target deals themselves to fix toxic damage at the start of each turn. So we're really glad that Fnatic didn't get this one. Yeah. That would suck.
All right. That was the one shot. This dis this end phase is discover an ongoing card. There is a wasting sickness. Who is going to start dealing themselves to toxic damage? Jeez, not. <laughs> All right. Some trainer you are. Some trainer. I gotta deal with unexpected <laughs> badness. Okay, so I'm gonna go. And I'm going to play Amulet of the Elder Gods. Plus one to my magical component if I had one. Whenever Night Mist would be dealt da infernal damage, you may bury one card from your hand. If you do, you may redirect that damage. Okay. Cool. Then I'm going to use my power. Select one hero character until your start phase each time that target deals damage, make it plus one or minus three. And I'm going to give that to Ra. Because his power is going to hit four targets regardless. I can't control it. And that could give me minus three on that so that he doesn't hurt us. Okay. I will draw a card during my draw phase and end my turn. That goes to Raw. At the start, this target deals itself two fixed toxic damage. Okay. So I will play the Staff of Raw, plus one damage dealt by Raw. Whenever Raw would deal fire damage to a target, you may double the damage if you do destroy the staff. Cool. Okay, then I am going to use Fight Fire with Fire. Ra deals four targets, one fire damage each. One hero may draw a card. So I am going to hit Plague Rat and the Plague Locust. I'm going to give plus one to both of those damage outputs, so that will be three damage to each of them. Okay. Countdown here in a second. Three damage. And then I will hit Fanatic and Scavenger Unity, but I'll put minus three on it, so it is negative one damage. You do not take any damage. Negative damage does not end up healing you, though. So. All right, good to know. <laughs> I'll draw a card and end my turn. All right. This card deals themselves two fixed toxic damage. <laughs> So this is the first time we're playing a set where I didn't plan out the characters having any kind of synergy, and I didn't make sure that we had, you know, support, damage dealer, tank situation. We just kind of got a random group, mostly just using uh, alternate characters from the Rook City Renegades box. So I grabbed alternates that existed in it. We didn't grab Hakka because I wanted to use Metro Night Mist, and this is what we got. I played a power. I'm okay. going to use that power to play two golems then destroy this card. Okay. So what golems do you got? Negative one damage dealt to this card. Whenever Unity or a mechanical golem target would be dealt damage, you may redirect it to this card. Fixed damage cannot be redirected, but after this card is dealt fire damage, it deals one target that much cold damage. At my end phase, this card deals up to three targets, one cold damage each. So, one, two, three. Okay. Draw a card. So that's Cryobot and Stealth Bot? Yes. Cool. And end my turn. Start phase. Highest HP? Me. Two. Toxic. Okay. Oh, lots these are of ongoing. Ongoings. Oh. Lots of ongoings. Yes. Highest HP. Themself, themself. And These two are fixed. fixed. Yeah. So which one should we get rid of? Doesn't matter. Fine, I'm getting rid of wasting sickness. Hey, destroy. Up to three targets, one radiant damage each. So just two. Power. Summon a relic. That's new. We haven't played this fanatic yet, so summon, you get to pick one. Just hearing that makes it sound pretty cool because that means it's much more like the apostate was. 
boss-wise with relics. That sounds cool. Absolution. Your sword. Right. Yep, my sword. Fnatic deals one target three melee damage. Then, if Fnatic is at ten or fewer HP, Fnatic deals one target two fire and two radiant damage. That sword is awesome when she is below ten health. <laughs> below ten health. <laughs> Which you always are. I always am right now. Uh, that was myself up. and one other target, one fixed infernal damage. Should I hit Flygrat or should I hit this Locust? Locust won't die to a hitting hit, but he might heal on his turn and I don't know. Okay. Hit that. Hit that? Yep. Were you in the calendar box? No. No. Dogs. We're cutting this part, by the way. Thanks. As she walks out of there with a fucking bird in her mouth, like that! Stay out of there! Oh, dodgy little shit. Tries to smack her in the mouth. <laughs> I drew a card. You have three, you did not. Draw a card, my turn. Okay. Freedom Tower. Freedom Tower. Ongoing room. At the end phase, each hero may draw a card. If all heroes draw cards this way, destroy this card. So we have one person not draw a card? Keep that going. Oh. Okay. Raw does not need cards, um, so everybody else can. Unity does. Cool. <clears throat> this is probably one of the safest environments, which is kind of why I chose it, because I knew Plague Rat, old Plague Rat was rough. Mean, okay, fair. And so I figured this guy would be the same. Alright, no start of effects on his turn. Also, we have to note plus one damage dealt by Plague Rat and all infected targets. Oh. So this. No, fixed damage. Yeah. So this would have been one more damage to my miss. Think. Oh. Highest HP, too. Yes. Okay. So yes, you gotta remember to put those markers out. Put those markers out. But that also means when I dealt out my blast, that was one more additional damage to that guy. And to like that. And then I still did, I did negative one at the time, so I still did zero damage yeah. when I hit all of us. All good. Cool. So, kind of some pros of being infected. infected. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, no start phases. He plays a card Slavering Slasher. Slavering. All right. Slavering. Slavering. She checked it because she didn't think I was right. Correct. Plague Rat deals the hero target with the highest HP one, two, damage. Me. Okay. Or you. No. Or do we have both 21? Yes. Then yes, I could redirect it. You want that thing to take one? One. This is what Stealth Bot is for. Yes. Then Plague Rat deals the hero target with the highest HP, two melee, plus one, three. So, I can take three. I mean, take two. Do you want to just keep doing this? Yeah. Okay. Then Plague Rat deals the hero target with the highest HP, three, four damage. That kills it. You want to do that? Yeah. Okay. Stealth Bot just ate that whole slash. That's a good bot. What a good bot. That was his play card. If there are three or more villain ongoing cards, one, two, three, no, one, two, we destroyed the other one. Mm -hmm. Two, there are not. Otherwise, Plague Rat deals the hero target with the highest HP, one of us two, four, plus one, five. Ouch. Sure, five puts me down at 16. Okay. Wait, is it hero target? Oh, highest health. Highest health. Never highest health. Then play the top card of the villain deck. Fatal Disease. A new infected. Either one hero discards two cards, or this target deals themselves four fixed toxic damage. Not her. Oh, she's infected. Yeah. So it has to be. It has to be one of these two, and they have to be able to discard cards. Okay. If you want me to take it, ask the question, man. You drew it over to your play area, so... Alright, I'll take it. We can try and destroy ongoings. <laughs> That's a mean one. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so let's play the top card of the villain deck from his end phase. This thing, discover an ongoing card. Ongoing. Here you go. Thanks. We are all infected now. Such infection. Wow. Such infection. <laughs> all right. He's a meanie head. He is. Here we go. Thanks. My turn. Either one hero discards two cards or infection. Okay, so I'll discard two cards. Discard these two cards, leaving the four on top. This one's fixed. Those two are not? Correct. Okay. Star Shield Invocation. Ma negative magic effect, which is currently five damage dealt to allies. Nice. Not myself. Yeah, allies only. Okay. I'll use this power. Yours is two and then two damage, this thing? Yes. Mm. Now I'm gonna give it to Ra again. Okay. Give it to Ra. Draw a card. And my turn. Ra. So that thing's at nine, five, six, seven. It has two health left. Sure. Inferno. Bra oh, first. This dark deal itself two fixed toxic damage, so I am at 14. Then I'll play Inferno. Ra deals one target, three, four, five, six fire damage. That'll give me boss two, seven, eight. Three, four, five, and then plus one from her using her power on him. Very good. So six. Raw deals each non-hero target, which is just that thing. One, two, three, four. Nice. Destroy. Then we all lose our plus ones. But as did the boss. Then I will use my power. My power. My power deal four targets, one fire damage each. So it is one, two, three to the boss, and then zero to a couple of us. Right there. Unless you want me to blast the cryobot for some fire damage. If you hit her for four, it would be four more to the boss. One. It was one damage. One, two, three. Yeah, but you're minus one, right? No, why would I minus one? Oh uh, no, 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 no. It's just it was just three to the boss then. Okay. Yes. Seventy-eight minus three. Yes. Three. Three damage. So I can blast it for three if you want. Yeah, okay. Okay, three fire damage onto the cryobot. I will not reduce it, I will do the increase. So three damage to the boss. Might as well use the cryobot for what it's for, right? Yeah. Mimicking absolute zero. In fact, each of the bots are mimicking somebody. Are they? Huh. That's race. Hmm. Absolute zero. What about the raptor bots? I don't know. Those are raptors. <laughs> Those are just cute. <laughs> okay, that's draw a card and end my turn. They're less cute now. I like the old ones. <laughs> it is your turn. What's your start? My start phase. Hero target with the highest HP to toxic damage. Minus five. Very good, very good. Um. What? Hmm. What? Allies. Sing? Specifically that keyword. <laughs> Seeing if a bot is an ally? Yes. So we couldn't have redirected that three damage. A target of the 
card's type. So it is a hero target, so it would have had minus five. It wouldn't have taken that damage. And we got to brought the boss back up three. Heal the boss for three. All right, very good. Okay, Jesus, I missed. We're gonna mess everything up. All right, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, that's the start phase. No damage. I get to play a card. Play a defense. One hero may use a, a power, plus two damage, dealt by that hero with that power. Fanatic deals one target, four fire damage, and four radiant damage. Four? Plus two. Plus two. All right, four and four is eight damage onto 75, brings it down to 66. Nice, good one shot scavenger. I may play a mechanical golem or item card from my trash. Stealth thought comes back to the game. Hey, you stealth thought. You're sorely missed. That's my power. Cool. I draw a card, and this card deals up to three targets, one cold damage each. Just that. Go, start phase. This target deals the hero target with the highest HP to toxic damage. Oh. Sure. Is it still negative to all of us? Yep. Perfect. Oh, yeah, negative. Not fixed. Yep. Good. Okay, this is fun. Fanatic deals one target, two melee damage, plus two. Why? Oh, with that power. Never mind. It doesn't stay. Okay. Two melee damage to the boss. Then, one, if Fanatic two. has ten or fewer HP, you do. she does. Use up to two powers. Cool. Four damage. For that power. Okay. And then I summon another relic. Cool. And do yourself one fixed and him one fixed? Yes. If you not. So new fanatic wants to be 10 or fewer HP, it mm -hmm. seems. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Relic, relic. And this one just starts you off there rather than you eventually getting there. Yeah. So this is like the equivalent of being fully built. <laughs> fully built. <laughs> Late game fanatic right out the gates. Okay, well I'm gonna take this one because just in case. Who knows? Rosary of the Mysteries. Shuffle your trash into your deck, discard five cards, draw five cards. Then if Fnatic has 10 or fewer HP, Fnatic regains up to five HP. That's super OP. All right, <laughs> all right, that's a new power you got. I got myself one fixed internal damage. I draw a card. No, I could still use a power. You used a power. No. Use the sword and this. Yeah, but then I played this, so I still have a power to use. This what? is a one shot that let me use up the two powers. What does it say? Use up to two powers on the player card. On yep. the one shot. You yeah, still so have that your power. Card, You're right. So I have You're my right. power phase. Wow. So I shuffle my trash into my deck. Okay. I don't have five cards to this card. So discard all of them. It's not then, so. Ah, okay. Yes. All those things have to occur. So shuffle, okay. discard, blast, or no, then deal. deal. But then you'll have no cards. Like all right. I draw five cards. I draw five cards. Oh, is it also draw five cards? Very so good. shuffle your trash, discard five. I don't have five, but I'm going to play those. Discard them all. Draw five cards. Then regains up to five health. I am back at full. And so now you just can't die. Unless you take 10 damage, or uh, unless you're taking over five damage a turn, I guess. Because that thing will heal you for five every time you use it. Yeah, if I choose to do that. <laughs> All right. It's fun, I like it, okay. Cool. Uh, I draw a card and it measures. Tower. 
Discover one target from the villain deck. Then a hero may use a power. Yeah. End phase. Each hero may draw a card. If all heroes draw this way, destroy this card. I don't need one. Okay. Everybody else can. No sudden laser in, in these decks? I don't think so. No. <laughs> that was new in... Harpies? RC. Mm. Okay. Discover one target from the villain deck. Should be rats in here, right? If we pulled all of the targets? There might just be the one. Oh. No targets. All right. Then, so because we didn't discover, does that mean we can't use a power? I believe so. When the then keyword is, the previous thing had to have occurred. Correct us if we're wrong, but we're gonna go with that. The previous thing had to have occurred. It did not because there were no targets. So the environment is done. Environment is done. He goes. No start phases. He plays a card. Destroy one item card. Okay, I will destroy the staff of Ra. Playgrat regains 4 HP. Each non-infected target, which is none, heals themselves damage. All right, there are three or more villain ongoing cards in play. Flip Playgrat on his end phase. Does he still get his new end phase? That's another thing I'm not 100% certain on. I think this card's end phase completes with that, and it's still the same card when it flips. I don't think it continues its end phase. I agree. But then that means it just skips a thing, which doesn't sound right for Sentinels. All right, so when he flips, we're going to assume a new card came into play, which is the flipped version, and its end phase will go, where Playgrad deals the H non-villain targets with the highest HP, one irreducible toxic damage each. One to each of us. Irreducible? Irreducible. But not, not redirect. Yeah, I'm still going to get a stat bot. He's done. I need someone to discard two cards. <laughs> take two or discard so I don't take four fixed psychic damage. At the start of my turn, I deal myself five infernal damage. I'm going to bury one card mm -hmm. to redirect that five damage to Plygrat, slapping him for five and putting him down to 58. Then destroy this card. All right. Then I can play a card. I will play Isolating Mists. Whenever a non-hero card would be played, you may discard one card. If you do, discard the non-hero card instead of playing it. Then Night Mist deals herself three at this point in for a I'll use my power this time. We're gonna use it on Fnatic. We're gonna try it out. What are we doing? I'm using my power on Fnatic, so you can either plus one or minus three any damage output. Okay. Then I will draw a card and then my turn. Ra 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 ra. Is it going to just blast? Oh no. Start, he deals himself two fixed psychic, going down to 11. He will blast Plague Rat for five. 
three. He'll use his power to blast Plague Rat for one. He's gonna blast Cryobot for one fire. Stealth Bot for zero fire. And Scavenger Unity for one fire. You can redirect it to. Oh, it's not fixed? No. Okay, so he absorbs it, one. Cryobot will deal it with one damage? One. Yep. Oh, so it's just one damage. But okay. And that absorbs. Okay. So we're good. And then one here we draw a card, I let her draw a card, and he is done. Okay. This hero highest HP to toxic damage. Her own self? Her own self. Two stealth bot and eight on six one. Nice. After any mechanical golem is destroyed, you may put it in your hand if you do destroy this card. Okay. You may play mechanical golem from... or item. Hmm. Item. Play. Play. I like it. Okay. That's your power. So, that let me play this mm -hmm. for my power, which is great. And then I draw a card. And then And fix. And fix. Three targets, one cold damage each. Just one. Think. Dip. Think. Should I deal myself one damage? To deal out one more damage? Why would I deal out? Oh. Oh, fire damage, not cold damage. Never mind. Mm. Fanatic deals one target two melee damage. Plus one? From me? Plus one. Then, hold on to that. If Fanatic has ten or fewer HP, use up to two powers. One, two, three, four, five, six. Forty. And one. Four. Get and yourself something. one and get a thing. Something relic. Myself on damage. Can I you should have summon multiple from my hand, though. No, trash or deck. Okay. Got it. Seems like that's the last one in your deck. <laughs> it is. So that was a play a card to use two powers. Yep. Now I have this one. But I need to quickly look at my hand and see if I actually want to do that. What's your new card? What's it called? What does it do? Aegis of Resurrection. When Fnatic will be reduced to zero, prevent that damage and destroy this card. When this card is destroyed, Fnatic regains 10 HP. Very good. Yeah. Cards. I just. I question if I can do this. It doesn't okay. say then. It doesn't but... say then. It just discards your hand and draws new cards, is the point of it. I'm surprised it doesn't destroy itself after. Me too. Use. Just seems super strong. Super strong. Okay, shuffling. I'm using that power. Shuffle your trash into your deck. Discard Just... five cards. Draw five cards. Heal two health. <laughs> Alright, that's fun. I draw a card and end my turn. New environment. After this card is played, destroy a room card. Doink. Plus one damage dealt by villain targets. End phase. Each hero may draw a card. Does Raw need a card? No. Okay. Raw does not. <laughs> Raw's being really Raw's nice to everyone else. <laughs> cool. That's it. Okay. 
Plague Rat. Plague Rat. Serve face. Oh, plus two damage dealt by Plague Rat. Missed that. Everybody. Each non villain targets with the highest HP, irreducible damage each. So that should have been two more. I should be down nine. Try and keep up with all those things. You should be down two more. And then Unity took it. And redirected it. To So do two damage to self thought. Okay. And do two damage to. Oh no, you would have just healed it. Yeah. Yeah. I healed up to five. So. You, healed, you were only at two and you healed five, so yeah. you'd, it'd be gone. All right. Okay. Missed that at the top. Okay. Start phase. Okay. Each infected hero may deal themselves four fixed toxic damage. Whenever a hero character is dealt damage in this way, destroy one villain ongoing card. Oh, that's kind of nice. I don't have to worry about it. Each of us take four, whereas we would only take two and two. And two. I should destroy that one. You could. Unless you're- you yeah. keep reducing our damage though, so. You either take four from that or you take four from that. Or I discard cards, and then it does nothing. Okay. So let's just discard cards. Heck, you can discard car bots and then play them from your trash. I can, yes. Yeah. I don't think we should. Okay. If you want any of yours gone, feel free. Yeah. Okay. Play phase. If there are no villain ongoing cards in play, shuffle the villain trash into the villain deck and flip. Oh wait, play this card next to an active non-infected hero card. If there are none, he heals. He heals. So he might get a big heal, but a four heal compared to- Four heal know. compared to dealing four damage to each of us? Yeah, okay. To one of us, whoever. One of us, us every time. Okay. Shovel the villain drives into the villain deck. <laughs> uh oh. Dang it. Decisions were made. Plague Rat deals the hero target with the highest HP three melee damage. If that hero is not infected, discover one villain ongoing card play. It is infected. I'm just wondering if I should make him not play this card, but I don't think it's that bad. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. So he's coming for you? Mm hmm. Um, nine. Okay. Three, four, five, six. I redirect it and he dies. Okay. If that target is not infected. That target was not infected. Should I just take it? Says, discover one villain ongoing card and play it next to that target. Oh, the target died. Yeah. So not a brick So not. Okay, sure. Okay, it's dead. We cannot infect it because it's dead. Done. Then, Plague Rat deals with each non villain targets with the highest HP, one irreducible toxic damage each. Two, three, four. Ow. Yep. Peach infected? Non-villain targets with the highest HP. Oh. So that's all of us, because we're all higher than a cryobot. So each of us takes four. I didn't realize this destroys at the start of my turn, but it's too late. We can't undo that mistake. Cool. He's done. Didn't you just play that this turn? I played it last turn at the start of this turn, which is now. It gets destroyed. Okay. So I didn't use it where I should have just used it to block mm. that attack. All right. I'll play it again. All right, first I need somebody to discard two cards, and she can't, she doesn't have enough, and Ra's not been drawing as many cards as everybody else. Two Then I will play that same thing. This time I will actually use it. Use my power oh, wait. on Fanatic. Stealth Bot goes into my hand because of this. If you choose to and destroy that card. 
Oh, if you do destroy this card. Hmm. Okay, no. Yeah, I'm gonna give that plus or my effect to Fnatic again. Okay. Yeah. Draw a card in the turn. Raw. Raw. Raw is going to play draw one card, summon the staff, play a card. Regaining the staff gives me plus one. Raw deals one target, five, six fire damage. Nice. Down to 34. Don't think it's worth it now to use his power. It would have to blast two of us for two. Unless you think you're gonna heal. Oh yeah, I'm gonna heal. You're gonna heal? All right, just making a face. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so if I use it, I can blast Plague Rat for two. One, two. And then you hit me for two. I hit Cryobot for two, and which I blasts him it. back. Yeah. Or I hit him back. Blasts him back for two. Then and take she takes one uh, or two, two, and then I have to hit one more person for two. He's at 17, so it's hurt. Okay. And then one player may draw a card. Unity. Sure. Unless you need it. No, it's fine. And I'll draw a card to end my turn. Okay. Start phase. You may play a card. If you do, destroy this card. Could be a golem. Yeah, I know. Okay. That's okay. how I play golems. Yeah. Yeah. Bebots. Bebot. I'm rock steady. <laughs> Hero target with the highest HP, two toxic damage. It's you. It's me. <laughs> <laughs> Nine times we sing that song. Ridiculous. Taylor Swift. Really How dare nice. you? Power. Play two Bebots. Why so many bots? Then destroy this card. Okay. I draw a card and end my turn. Deals up to three targets, one cold damage each. It's only one cold damage. Are you gonna kill your bots? You want me? I guess. One, two, three, four, five, six more damage to him. Okay, and they're gonna destroy oh. ongoings. Yes. So which three plagues do we want gone? That one. So that was one damage from the cryobot, and then he killed he hit two of your bots, no, so one's still just, alive. You're not gonna hit him? Just hit all three. Okay. So all three bots damage. is six damage, so that it brings him to twenty-four. And, and there's three destroy plays. all three. There's one that you won't. That hit himself? Yes. Okay, get rid of that one. Okay. This is the one we can resist by just people discarding cards. Fine, get rid of this one. Oh, but I keep using my power to reduce your thing. I don't know. Okay, two. One more. That one? Okay, three. Gone. Hey, if we can destroy one more, he'll flip back and not have this. Going that would be on. great! Okay, okay, <laughs> cool, cool, cool. I drew a card. And, oh, no, that was your end phase. And okay. that was my end. Yep. Okay! Well, let's see if I have a destroy ongoing. So I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so two, you're adding plus I'm one to two, so three, thing. six, nine, ten. Wait, why nine? I'm so confused. Okay. Okay. I deal three melee damage to the boss. One, two, plus one, three. Okay. Cool. I use this power. That power is two and two, which is three and three, which is six. Yes. Okay. So fifteen. I use this power okay. to deal him one more. Fixed. Fixed. I okay. deal myself that one damage. Yep. That ends my play a card phase. You know you have no relics, so you're not gonna look for one. None in your trash and none in your deck. 
discarded something. Is it valid? It might not be. Checking. Hold, please. No. Okay, no relics. And there's none currently in your trash. And summon can go from the trash out as well. I thought it couldn't. No, summon can. No. Okay. <laughs> That's it. Three relics. No relics. Yes. Yes. Four, but no. Okay. Then shuffle your trash into your deck. You got it. I don't have to discard everything. Discard four. Okay. Discard five? Discard five. five. Draw five. Heal five. Okay, you guys, this is a lot of fun. She's really liking this. <laughs> didn't think she would, and I then she did. I didn't think I would. I was like, I'm just gonna die so early. Come on. So. Oh, finally. All right, draw a card. Now my turn. Okay. This card counts as a hero target. It is immune to damage dealt by hero targets. Cool. Okay. Each hero may draw a card. If all heroes do draw cards this way, destroy this card. Not allowed to Okay. <laughs> not allowed. You keep throwing them away. <laughs> you obviously don't value them. I don't value them. Still plus one damage dealt by villain targets. Yep. This card deals the villain target with the highest HP to lightning damage. Okay. Freedom security staff. Thanks, boys. That was helpful. Boom. Plague Rat. Start phase. Each infected hero may deal themselves four fixed toxic damage. Sure. Are you doing it? Yep. Down to nine. Destroy this. Why is it destroyed? May destroy it. Play phase. If there are no villain ongoing cards in play, shuffle the villain trash into the villain deck and flip it. It's back to that side and only has plus one. From this. From that. Okay. Should have destroyed that ongoing. Plays a card. Ongoing. Fatal disease. <laughs> Same one. All right. <laughs> sure. <laughs> it's working. The mentor okay. is dying. No, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one. I'm gonna discard. What do I have to do? Let me discard one card, all right? Well, we don't need Oblivion. Yep, Nightmare deals herself that much to three. I will bury a card. To redirect it to him? To redirect it to him. Three damage? Three infernal damage. Nice. He is at nine health, you guys. So he didn't play that card. End phase. If there are three or more villain ongoing cards in play, there are not. Plague Rat deals the hero target with the highest HP, four, five. Can't do it. Oh. You said there are not, so that... I no, otherwise. Mm. Okay. Highest five. Scavenger. Ow! <laughs> then play the top card of the villain deck. Wasting Sickness. <laughs> Dealing yourself to toxic damage. Here you go. Wow, thanks. Yep. Real nice. Real nice. <laughs> Okay. Night Mist. Night Mist. What you doing? Destroy this card. Do you drink your hot chocolate? Stop it. Bam. This card is the top card of your deck. Bam. Night Mist deals one target, two plus one, three. Irreducible Infernal damage. Raw gains three, irreducible health. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Up to eight. Nice. Friendship. <laughs> Friendship. <laughs> All eight health. Then I'll use my power on Raw, giving him plus one or minus three damage dealt. 
I'll draw a card and end my turn. You better deal six damage right now. Raw. To the boss, not to <laughs> split amongst all of us. <laughs> You can't deal any damage? <laughs> this is happening right now. <laughs> yeah, a little bit of that. I think it's seven health. Plus one right now. Alright. Okay, I'll play Living Conflagration. Then on my power phase, I will destroy Living Conflagration. When this card is destroyed, Rod deals one target, three, four, five fire damage. One health. And draw two cards. He's on his last limbs. <laughs> oh, I can double it. I'll destroy this time, Rod, and double it. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! <laughs> nice. Nice! Okay, that was fun. I had, like, I finally just pulled a plus one damage from my allies. There's a reveal the top four cards of your deck. Put any item or ongoing cards revealed this way into your hand. So if you're not able to build up, you've got some build up ability. Uh, end of days, which is uh, fun at the start destroy phase. Everything. Just destroy everything. Yeah, except character cards. And then a one shot, Holy Nova, you know, just running around. One damage, one damage, one damage. <laughs> yep, good times. So Staff of Ra doesn't heal him anymore. Mm -hmm. And that felt like the only change. I'm yeah. sure it's not the only change, but... It, it felt like it. Yeah. It felt like that was the only thing that was different. So um, maybe he was well-balanced and well-rounded before. I think he was well-known yeah. to be a really balanced character, yeah. and he's just balanced again, and that power was just kind of fun. I was I was dealing with it mentally of, like, how do we handle this? Having Night Mist to reduce it at the start helped out, and mm -hmm. then I moved it on once we had ways to deal with it. Uh, Mentor Night Mist is really strong. Yeah. That is a That's super a really strong, strong power. power. It would work really well with Alpha. Mm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So when she does her mega claw at the end of the She's turn, either you allies. increase it yeah. by one <laughs> so it deals even more damage to enemies, or you decrease it by three and she doesn't hurt allies. Yeah. Really, that'd be cool. Really powerful. That's a super strong one. That felt stupidly strong. That was. I think I got the relics out so fast that they really played off of each other, and then I kept getting that same one shot. Yeah, and letting you use so many powers. Yeah. Uh, I like scavenger unities, be able to play a golem from the trash. That was nice. If I don't do it, I get to draw cards and discard a card. So that helped me be able to build up a hand and pull out some bots. So that was cool. Plague Rat, I'm very well redesigned, I think. I think those difference in the infected, it's not just the one infected that said at the start of your turn you deal yourself two damage. Like, mm. I think it being all sorts of different types of sicknesses that he gives out was really cool. One of those things that makes it more like the other bosses where there's more stuff that you have to track, which makes him a little bit more interesting than he used to be. Yeah. Um, they got rid of all of the other targets in his deck though. There used to be like a mound of rats and a couple of other rats, right? Right, I'm pretty sure. I mean, we can check. We have the big box. We have the but... big box. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he had a couple of more targets. He might have had only one other target. I thought he had more than one, where now he only has the Plague Locus. So, not as much targets, not as much as to deal with. You're really just dealing with Plague Rat, which is okay. It's fine to have a boss that you just deal with the boss. But pretty fun. Great game. That was a fun and exciting time. We've only got, I think, two-ish bosses left in the new box that we haven't fought yet. Cool. I think we just got Spite and Gloom. So those will be coming up.